It has been 11 years since terrorists attacked the United States on September 11, 2001. U.S. Army Japan and I Corps Forward hosted its annual 9-11 Remembrance Ceremony at Camp Zama's Community Activity Center to commemorate the tragic event and honor those who died in the attacks and in the resulting conflicts in Iraq and Afghanistan. I always feel duty and honor when it comes to the fallen. It doesn't have to be a soldier, anybody that we lose for something that's just so criminal. During the ceremony, narratives were read by soldiers and civilians that recounted the fates of the four commercial aircraft that were hijacked and crashed in New York, Washington, D.C., and Pennsylvania. A memorial wreath was laid by Acting USAJ Command Sergeant Major Katrina Naji. For the first time, we faced a decade of conflict with an all-volunteer force. And when I refer to the servicemen and women, that includes all those who make up our military, DAX, contractors, MLCs, and family members. For it is all of them and all of us that make us strong, both in the Army and in the United States military. The ceremony concluded with a moment of silence that paid tribute to the victims of 9-11 and the service members who have sacrificed their lives in the ongoing global war on terrorism. I hope especially the younger soldiers understand why we are where we are today, um, that we lost so many people, but not to remember the few that did so wrong, but remember the many that did so great. I think that's the most important thing. We should never forget, never. Reporting for U.S. Army Garrison Japan Public Affairs, this is Dustin Perry.